Yeah. Uh, yeah, it just seems like there's a lot of buildings. And Um, this is usually like this is our peak time, so it's oh. always it gets like very, very busy. Like okay. yesterday was insane. The day before really? was insane. The day before that was insane. Oh no kidding! Yeah, this is a light morning now, which oh. is good. Perfect. Like, around noon is gonna get back crazy. Okay. So yeah, let's see how much we can drink before <laughs> then. <Yeah>. Okay. <laughs> Nevertheless, welcome to Foursquare of Distillery. My name is Dario, by the way, so I'll be your guide for this morning. Now, Foursquare, this distillery is situated on one of the oldest sugar estates here in Barbados, which dates back to around the mid 1650s. And that would be this entire compound or immediate surroundings and what the facility here uses to be. Now, our distillery, the building itself, this occupies, our, our from the distillery occupies the abandoned site of what uses to be a sugar factory years ago. Mm. So this would have ceased operation as a factory in 1989. The entire property up here, everything was left abandoned and stood idle for about six years or so. Um, 1995 was the year that this site was acquired by the Seals family. And they would be the only remaining family rum producing company here on the island. Oh. And out of the four distilleries in Barbados, where Square is one of two out of these four, which is 100% owned by a Barbados, so it's all locally owned. Okay. That's great. Yeah. So what we're we gonna do? We're gonna head up this way. This building here is the old Way Bridge. Yeah. I just, I just heard the weight went up on the yeah. outside. Yeah. So yeah. this has the capacity to weigh approximately 16 tons. Wow. Yeah. Wow. In, in those days, cane was brought here and weighed, driven to the top. When we get to the top, there's uh, an area that has an amphitheater set up. That mm -hmm. is what uses to be the, the cane pit. Oh, that's where sort they of dropped the cane right in there? That was temporary. That's why it was straight. Oh, Correct. Okay. Yeah. So it's kind of like how Sir David area. decided to, to fill the void. Oh, okay. <laughs> so there are a few events held there. Um, Locals get very creative um, with utilizing the facility because we do get you know, we know that um, a lot of weddings are held yes. on the facility as well. Like, you know, the coat, so the this coat of over the top, we got mats and we stamp the impression into that uh, so it makes it look like natural. Okay, 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 okay. Very and cool. The, all this time we thought that these were like some small little tubs. No, no, no. <laughs> Not only Stamped. yeah, recently I, I realized that. Yeah, you figured that out when you get the lines like this. Yeah, that's kind of how you know it was concrete. Yeah, for me it was too perfect, man. <laughs> yeah, right. Dario, where oh. did the name Foursquare come from? Uh, Foursquare came from this area. The name Foursquare. All right. Uh, so, if if your residence would have been just across the road, mm -hmm. your residence would be your address would be Foursquare. So, oh. so the sugar factory here was called Four Square Sugar Factory. The estate was Four Square Estate on, okay. on very old maps. I think there 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 are some maps that, like there are some pretty old maps that I think they saw the area marked as for pawn area. That may be subject to correction, but I gotta oh. look back and check through my notes. But those are some very old maps of Barbados that this air area was called, I think, Four Pond area. Yeah. This is the old cane pit. Also in this area you have over here the world's second largest cricket bat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we sadly both that because we have to stand to tell you that we're not that we have a large bat. Uh, a larger bat. And the building over here used to be the um, the garage. Tractors of oh, the back okay. of the uh, It's what you would call a. Uh, well, there's an Airbnb thing. Right? Really? Two at the top and two at the bottom, yeah. Oh, the bedrooms. Huh. Yeah, bathrooms. Yeah, I'm pretty good if you don't mind strangers walking around. Oh, no. You're pretty, very transparent. Hi. Hi. How are you? Hi. We're looking for like a main entrance or. Oh. Yeah. You can. So this is the first step to fermentation. When they start to 
We use a combination of both local and important. Okay. That's a good period. Oh, it doesn't So the boiler this is used to produce steam when the facility was a sugar factory back in the early days. So they took the crushed sugar cane back. Uh, it is the trash is what we would call for gas. It is used to fuel the boiler uh, for the production of steam. And this steam is what already machinery is back then. Yeah, after the pressure on the for coal in the boiler. Alright, so this is our yeah, get some other noise out there now. <laughs> this is our distillation area immediately. In front of us is what you call a hot still. Uh, to the very back of the room, you're gonna see columns. The same yeah. as all the same as yeah. all. That one, well, that's rock. Well, that's some fresh insulator. And the oh, yeah, those are still the columns. Now, is it is there a difference? Is it copper? Do they have a pot? Is that yeah. a copper thing? Yeah. 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 Recycled CO2 from the distillation pub. Thank you. 